Well, we're really excited that the Common Core Standards ask teachers to do a few things very well. And we've been making similar changes in AP through a parallel process, the redesign of, of AP Science and History courses that do the same thing. They ask teachers to concentrate on a smaller amount of content in much greater depth with a focus on skills that are going to last into college and careers. So the, the work that is happening in the Common Core will help uh, students prepare for what they're going to encounter in these redesigned AP courses and, be, and take with them into college the sort of knowledge and skills that really last. So, so we do expect that the Common Core will have different impacts on different AP subject areas. For example, in AP English, the Common Core is so well aligned with what is valued and taught in the AP English courses that the Common Core will prove to be excellent preparation for AP English and College English. In math, it's a, it's a slightly different matter. AP Calculus sits outside of the Common Core. The, the calculus is not part of the Common Core sequence. And in fact, the Common Core asks that educators slow down the progression through math so that students learn college-ready math very, very well. So that can involve a sequence that does not culminate in AP Calculus. There may still be AP tracks towards AP Calculus for students who are interested in majoring in engineering or other STEM disciplines. But by and large, the, the Common Core math sequence is best suited to prepare students for AP Statistics or AP Computer Science, which have dependencies on, on the math uh, requirements of the Common Core.